Hello everyone, my name is Devendra and today I'm going to be talking about our work on learning to explore using Active Neural Slam. Exploration is a key challenge in building long-term navigation agents. When an autonomous agent is dropped in an unseen environment, it needs to explore as much of the environment as fast as possible. Exploring efficiently in a large environment requires the agent to know three things. Where it has been before, where it is now, and where it needs to go. Knowing which areas are explored previously requires long-term memory or a map. Knowing where it currently is requires state or pose estimation and deciding where to go next requires long-term planning. Previous work has used end-to-end -end reinforcement learning for exploration. Learning about mapping, pose estimation and planning implicitly in an end-to-end -end fashion is expensive and sample inefficient. This makes prior methods ineffective at exploration in large environments. We propose a modular system called Active Neural Slam. It uses spatial structured representations, hierarchical policies, and an analytical planners for learning to explore effectively in large environments. The Active Neural Slam model consists of three components. The first one is called Neural Slam. It predicts a top-down 2D map and the agent pose from incoming RGB observations and sensor pose readings. The map here consists of obst obstacle predictions shown in green and the explored area prediction shown in blue. The second module called global policy takes in this predicted map and poses input and outputs a point on the spatial map as the long-term goal. Given the long-term goal, we plan a path to the goal using an analytical planner such as Dijkstra or Astar. We then sample a short-term goal on this path, which is fed to the third module called the local policy. The local policy learns to take navigational actions to reach this short-term goal based on first-person observations. Here we show a demo video of the active neural SLAM model trained on the Gibson dataset in the Habitat Simulator. The first-person RGB observations are shown on the left and the model predictions are shown on the right. The video shows that the agent can predict the map and pose fairly accurately and learn to explore in unseen environments effectively. Our results show that our model can improve the exploration performance by over 15% as compared to end-to-end -end RL-based baselines on the training Gibson domain. And we also see that the model performs better than the baselines on a different Matterport 3D domain. We show that the active neural SLAM model can not only be transferred to a different domain for the exploration task, but also to the point goal task with different domains and harder goals. For transferring to the point goal task, we simply use the point goal as the long-term goal instead of using a global policy. The active neural SLAM model was also the winner of the CVPR 2019 Habitat Point Null Navigation Challenge in both RGB and RGBD tracks. Finally, we, we also show that our model can be transferred from simulation environments to the real world. Here we use the Locobot hardware platform and the PyRobot API to deploy our models trained in simulation to the real world. The video here shows a demo of our agent predicting the map and pose in a real world apartment scene and exploring it efficiently. For more details on the method and additional results, please visit our project webpage. We have also released the complete code base, including pre-trained models. Thank you for listening. My name is Devendra, and I'm happy to answer any questions over email.